Well, hello everyone. I hope you're having a wonderful day. My name is Jay and welcome to the channel. Here on my channel, I have the opportunity to teach you how to speak better English. And today, as usual, we're going to have some fun. I'm going to go over some bathroom commands that you can use in English. This is going to be fun. Uh, I had fun putting this together. And so these are some common sentences or phrases that you can use uh, when you're in the restroom or talking to someone about things that go on in the bathroom. So let's have a little fun. Bathroom commands in English, okay? All right, our first one is wash your hands. Wash your hands. And of course, everyone needs to wash their hands when they come out of the restroom, in my opinion. So wash your hands. Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. Whether you're talking to a child or someone else, you can encourage them, don't go to bed, make sure you brush your teeth. Or while you're in the restroom, make sure you brush your teeth. Another simple sentence that you can practice your English, as far as commands in the bathroom, you could say, wipe the seat. Wipe the seat. So sometimes uh, boys or grown men may leave water or something else <laughs> on the seat of the toilet. And so you could just say, wipe the seat. All right? Flush the toilet. We only want to see clean water in the toilet. Flush the toilet. Bring me some paper or some toilet paper. Bring me some toilet paper. Don't you hate, at least it's a pet peeve of mine, when someone uses the last piece of toilet paper and they don't restock it. Then when I go to the restroom, there's no toilet paper. So you could say, bring me some toilet paper, okay? Another sentence that you can use, especially in your family, hurry up, I need to use the bathroom. Hurry up, I need to use the bathroom, okay? Someone that's taking all day, they need to hurry up. <laughs> Light a match. <laughs> Light a match. And you would tell someone to light a match in the restroom when they woo, when they when they have made the bathroom smell pretty bad. Light a match. Spray some aerosol. Spray some aerosol. Or some people may say deodorizer or smell good, but spray something to get the bad smell out of the bathroom turn the water off turn the water off some people like to leave the water running while they do different things in the restroom okay and so you would say turn the water off don't use all the hot water don't use all the hot water don't you hate that when everyone takes a bath or a shower and they use all the hot water and when you get in there, it's none left. And so you have to wait for the water to get hot again. Another pet peeve of mine, don't use all the hot water. Empty the trash in the bathroom. That's a great command. Empty the trash in the bathroom. Clean the tub, clean the tub. And so some people have a tendency to use the tub or the shower, get out and don't clean up after themselves. So you could use the instructions or the command, clean the tub. Our last one for today that you can practice, don't put that in the toilet. Don't put that in the toilet. So you may have to tell someone the only thing that goes in the toilet or the commode is toilet paper. But sometimes kids like to put toys, 
Uh, sometimes females may put personal items in the toilet. And so you may have to instruct them, don't do that. And so you could say, don't put that in the toilet. Well, I hope you have enjoyed today's lesson. You can go back and practice and watch this video and use these commands in your daily conversations as it pertains to what goes on in the bathroom. If I missed one, leave it down in the comment section. If you learned something, give me a like. And of course, if you know someone that is trying to speak better English, please consider sharing this video. Thank you so much, as usual, watching today's lesson. Be sure to check out some of my other videos here on the channel. If you're not a subscriber, make sure you subscribe, and I hope you have a wonderful day. God bless you.